Welcome to the Did You Know series. Today we're going to talk about the Hotel Vancouver, now known as the Fairmont Hotel Vancouver. Some of Canada's most unique features are the majestic railway hotels that were built across the country by the Canadian Pacific and the Canadian National Railways. For their time, these hotels were miracles of construction and engineering. Everything that went into them was the biggest and best of their time, and they had become very much a part of Canada's national heritage and identity. The Fairmont Hotel Vancouver is actually the third hotel to be named Hotel Vancouver. Though its name and heritage date back to 1888, the present Hotel Vancouver opened its doors in 1939 on the eve of the royal visit of King George VI and Queen Elizabeth. Considered a feat of engineering upon completion, the Hotel Vancouver's timeless luxury and iconic design inspired awe through the years in visitors and locals alike. The first Hotel Vancouver was a five-story brick structure that looked and functioned much like a farmhouse. The second was built over four-year span between 1912 and 1916. When it opened in 1916, it became the meeting place for Vancouver society. It was built in a grand Italian revival style and was considered one of the great hotels of the British Empire. The second Hotel Vancouver was turned into a government administration building during World War II and torn down in 1949. Canada's present Hotel Vancouver took 11 years to build because construction was halted for five years during the Great Depression. It was started by the National Railway but was finally completed under a joint operating agreement with the Canadian Pacific Railway. Hotel Vancouver in British Columbia was opened on May of 1939 in time for the royal visit of King George VI and Queen Elizabeth at a final cost of $12 million. The hotel has been a landmark in the city ever since and has hosted many significant events. Shortly after opening, the Canadian Broadcasting Corporation, also known as the CBC, started broadcasting from the hotel's 17th floor, its home until 1975. The beloved Dal Richards Orchestra performed from the legendary Panorama Ballroom, known today as The Roof. Fairmont Hotel Vancouver's recently completed $55 million renovation offers guests elegant accommodations inspired by the hotel's rich history with updated modern amenities. The renovations included 507 guest rooms, 14th floor heritage suites, a new reception lobby, and Notch 8 restaurant. In spring 2019, the hotel celebrated its 80th anniversary with the launch of a new luxurious Fairmont Gold product. Personally, I find the building is just amazing. The interior and exterior details are part of the rich culture and history of Canada. And even if you're not staying at the Hotel Vancouver, I do recommend that you take time to enjoy a meal at the Notch 8 restaurant or just take a walk through the many uh, amenities and stores such as Gucci, Louis Vuitton, and others that are within the building as, as well. Again, this is a segment of Did You Know? Brought to you by Carry Movers and Propix Canada Media. Again, the information contained here was from the Fairmont.com. Welcome to the Did You Know series. Today we're going to talk about the Hotel Vancouver, now known as the Fairmont.